Hi, my name is Ushna Alan. I'm a second year internal medicine resident at Montevideo Wakefield. Today, I'm going to talk about non-invasive ways of diagnosing MASLD and MASH. So what do these two terms mean? MASLD stands for Metabolic Associated Steatotic Liver Disease. It's a condition in which there is excess fat accumulation in your liver, liver cells. Over time, this accumulated fat causes liver injury known as inflammation, at which point this is, the disease is called metabolic associated steatohepatitis. This eventually leads to liver scarring, which is known as liver cirrhosis. This is a silent disease, meaning it develops and progresses in your body without causing any obvious symptoms which you can feel or notice. So what puts you at risk? Conditions such as diabetes, hypertension, obesity, and high cholesterol promote fat accumulation and put you at an increased risk for developing this disease. So let's talk about di diagnosis. Diagnosis often begins uh, when you're found to have abnormal liver enzymes on routine blood work or when you're incidentally found to have fat accumulated on imaging done for other reasons. The best test is actually liver biopsy, but it's quite invasive as, as it involves taking a piece of your liver using a large needle and examining it under the microscope. But I'm going to talk about the non-invasive options that we now have for diagnosing this disease. So your doctor is going to start with uh, taking a thorough medical history, assessing for risk factors, performing a physical exam to check for enlarged liver or other causes of liver damage. The second step is going to be doing some blood work to check for liver function, diabetes, cholesterol, and other causes of liver disease. The third step is going to be imaging. Now with imaging, we're looking at two things. Number one, um, fat accumulation, for which we can use an ultrasound or in some cases a CT scan or an MRI. A CT scan and an MRI are better in larger patients in whom ultrasound is not the most accurate. The second thing that we look for with imaging is um, called fibrosis, which is liver scarring. For this, we use a special type of um, ultrasound known as a fiber scan or a special type of MRI called an MR elastography. Early diagnosis is important as it allows for timely management and preventing of serious complications. If left untreated, it, it can progress to serious liver conditions such as liver cirrhosis, liver failure, or liver cancer.